We are excited for this next segment here. As kids head back to school, local nonprofit is giving them the opportunity to really make a difference in the community. That's right. Philanthropy Tank is opening up applications to fund new student projects. We love talking to them. We have them on the show all the time. And joining us this morning is Francis Fisher, a philanthropist investor, and Nisha Joffrey, a Philanthropy Tank student. Uh, thank you so much, ladies, for joining us. Francis, let's start with you. What should students focus on when applying for Philanthropy Tank? Well, delighted to be with you and with Nisha, who is a shining star among over 500 teens who have been empowered by this program. Um, the most important thing that a student applying can focus on is a, a, a pressing need for, for social change, something specifically targeted to help those in need in Palm Beach County. And Francis, why um, they Oh, sorry, I didn't mean to interrupt you. Tell us a little bit more, too, why you chose to, you know, get involved with this as a philanthropist investor. Well, I think I can speak on behalf of all of our investors. Um, there is nothing more rewarding than embarking on an entrepreneurial journey where we're engaged firsthand with students um, to creatively and critically address uh, pressing needs in our community. Anisha, let's hear from you now. You know, if we just talked to you a little bit during the break. You're on your way to Yale. Congratulations on, on going to college. We've had you on before to talk about Hello Hygienics, but uh, give us an update on how Hello Hygienics has gone and how Philanthropy Tank changed your life. Absolutely. You know, this past year has been incredible for us. Um, we've actually been able to distribute over 2,000 hygiene kits to homeless and low-income low families here in South Florida, in addition to partnering with a variety of community organizations, even collaborating with the school district of Palm Beach County. And at the si same time, we've been able to continue our mission in educating um, teens and people in Palm Beach County and raising awareness about health, and health inequities that currently exist here. Nisha, what a journey it's been for you. You know, what have you learned over the last year and, and maybe what surprised you the most about all this? Absolutely. I think what I learned and the same can go for my year of five peers is really truly what it, what it means to take initiative in your community through the resources and the funding provided by Philanthropy Tank. We've been able to meet people from every corner of the community and that in itself has uh, been so amazing. Uh, gaining those that confidence, that sense of initiative and community awareness. Uh, those are skills that I will be able to take wherever I go. And um, I'm already really a very extroverted person. And even they still got me so many chances to step out of my comfort zone and learn more about my community than I did before. So. Anisha, good luck to you at Yale. Francis, thank you so much for joining us. We're going to be posting this interview on our website with all the information that people need to know to submit applications uh, to Philanthropy Tank. And, of course, we're going to keep on following the whole process all year long like we do each year. Like we said, we love Philanthropy Tank. Such good work they're doing.